Hey YouTube, I'm gonna show you how to jailbreak your iPhone 3GS. Um, my software is 3.1.2, but um, I downgraded it a few days ago, cause so I can jailbreak it, of course. I have a new boot ROM, and uh, this is an iPhone 3GS. Just so you know. So here's what you need, iPhone 3.1.2 firmware, Red Snow 0.9.2, and Black Rain. So, that's all you need, so let's get started. I've already jailbroke my iPod, so um, I will not be doing this, but I'll be doing this with you, but still, just follow along. First, you're going to put your iPod, iPhone in DFU mode. And uh, for those of you who don't know how to do that, you're going to hold down the home and the power button at the same time for 10 seconds. And then uh, after 10 seconds, you're going to release the power button and keep holding the home button for 10 more seconds. Make sure that your iPod or iPhone is connected to your computer so that you can hear the noise. Your computer should make a beep in Sec after the second time you count 10 seconds that will let you know that you're done okay so after you put your iPo iPhone in DFU mode you're gonna hold down shift and click restore so now you're going to select your iPhone firmware and then um, just click open since I've already done this I'm not going to go along with you so, um, I'm just going to click cancel, but just click open, and then, uh, just click restore. And then, uh, then your iPhone should restore, and, uh, that will probably take a little bit, depending on your computer and iPhone. But, uh, when it's done, you should get an error message that is completely normal. Just hit OK, and do what I just did again um, okay so after you've done that and uh, for the second time you got the error message again if you didn't get the error message then that's great your software is 3.1.2 uh, then skip ahead to the video end of the video if it, you didn't get the second error message and you were one of the lucky people so this is what you gotta do if you did get the error message the second time. Open Red Snow and open the application. Browse for the firmware that you just used to downgrade iPhone 3.1.2. Open it. And then it should process and uh this is really important you need to know if your model is new boot ROM or old boot ROM mine is a new boot ROM so I'm gonna hit yes um, so now I'm gonna hit next it's gonna patch the kernel which I have no idea what that means but I don't really want to complain because this works so gonna patch the kernel and uh, then it's done so I'm not gonna install Cydia and uh, do not make sure install Cydia is unchecked very important just check boot tether right now and then hit next okay well my so this is what you gotta do uh, put your, dev your device should still be in DFU mode but uh I took mine out of it. So uh yeah, if your device is still is not in DFU mode, just just um put it back in DFU mode. Not that hard. So um I've already done this and uh so after you go through all that then you just open up Black Rain, click make it rain, and then you're done.